Yo, 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 YouTube, welcome and thank you for joining me on today's video. I am having a go at uh, an app, a game called BitLife. As you can see, um, we're starting off as a new life. So um, one presumes it's a game where it asks you questions and your life develops depending on how you answer these questions. So uh, let's see where this life takes us. So I am Daniela Silverstein. I am an infant. I am zero years old. I was born a female in Minneapolis, United States. I was a planned pregnancy. My birthday is August the 7th. I'm a Leo. My name is Daniela Silverstein. Got that. My father is Will, who's a writer. My mother is Savannah, a trucker. Interesting mix. I have an older sister named Electra. We have a family cat named Silver. Cool. I'm 97% happy. I'm a baby. What's there not to be happy about? I'm 95% healthy, 57% smart, and 13% in the looks department. Oh, okay. So what do we do here? I guess we go to age. I'm now a year old. Oh dear. I've gone down in the looks department a little bit. We just keep aging. Yeah, I don't see much happening. Oh, you broke your parents' windshield while you were playing baseball. Oh, what will you do? Well, we're a good child, Daniela. I admit that I broke it. Your cat Silver gifted you by leaving a dead snake on the pillow. Lovely. I'm going to yell at the cat for doing that. I don't want that. Stupid cat. You screamed at your cat Silver. I'm now seven. Eight, nine, you, you just discovered your cat, Silver, drinking water out of your glass. <gasps> what will you do? Well, I'm going to yell at him. Dirty cat. Your cat, Silver, attacked you. Ah! He sliced open your finger. He bit your eyelid. He clawed your rump. What a naughty cat. What are my parents going to do about this? Come on, parents. Do something about it. Mother. Hmm, not much. I'll pay her a compliment then. I told her that she was awesome. What should we do with my sister? I'll have a conversation with her. Right. Oh, we got, oh dear. A conversation turned into a disagreement. We got into a heated argument. Oh no, discussing the best candy writer game. What will you do? Well, I'm not apologising, because it's my opinion. I'm insulting her, assault her. We'll have to agree to disagree, Alexa. No, Electra. Oh, my happiness is not great. Look, and my health is declining. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Maybe Dad can help me. Come on, Dad, help me out here. Can we, can we go to the movies? Let's go to the movies. Let's go, Dad. Your father took you to the theatre to see Big Boy's Little Adventure. He seemed to get more of it out of it than me. Should we get another pet? I don't like the cat. Let's go shopping for a pet. Um, let's go to an animal shelter. What's going to annoy the cat? A dog would annoy the cat. Let's go for for lateral the five-year-old dog he's a mutt let's adopt him oh no they wouldn't let me do it that's made me sad oh boo that's not right oh see the cat's dead should have got the dog now, oh dear, I've been diagnosed with depression. Oh no, at 12, that's really sad. Let's go visit the doctor. Let's try some other doctor. Cause she, he, she, Shaniqua Beaver has determined you are currently suffering from depression. We've got treatments, this is good. And I'm no longer suffering from it. Excellent, I'm cured apparently. At 13. Okay, now let's go on to 14. 
I've got flu. Oh dear. Do we go to the doctor? Not really a doctor can do much about flu unless there's complications. We'll go to Dr. Odell. What treatments has he given me? Oh, well he's fixed me, whatever it is. That's good, my health has jumped up to 91%. Brilliant. Uh, what about my dad? What are we going to do? Dad, let's spend time together. Oh, baseball game. Fabulous. I like a game of baseball. And then I suppose so my mother doesn't feel left out. Let's spend some time with dear old mum. Oh, we've gone to pick flowers. Brilliant. Okay, well, look, happy, healthy, working on the smart. Let's go up to 15. You are feeling strong heterosexual tendencies. What are you? Well, I'm straight then, aren't I, if I'm a heterosexual? It's time to take your driving test. Yeah, let's do it. It means um, sharp curve. Well done. Yay, I passed my driving test at 16. I'm guessing this is American then. Because I think you have to be 17 in the UK to do that. Oh, well done, Electra. Pa graduated from high school. I've got my license. Yeah, lovely. Uh, I'm going to work on my body. Meditate some more. Brilliant. Uh, we'll now be a bit older. We graduated as well. Fabulous. I'm going to apply to university. What should we do? Oh, I don't know. Let's go into maths. How will you pay? Oh my gosh, it costs just under $16,000 a year for four years. <gasps> Let's go for a scholarship. Oh, been rejected. Let's go for a student loan then. Let's do it. Brilliant. 21. Nothing happens at 21. Final year, so we've got to study harder. Final year. Let's do it. You graduated with an undergraduate degree in maths. Well done, me. What am I going to do now? I'm going to look for a job. I need some money. What shall we do? Um, junior financial analyst. Shall we try that? Apply for it. No, I didn't get it. Okay. Uh, stop broker. No, I didn't get that either. A nude art model. I'm not sure I fancy that idea. Should we go for a receptionist? Didn't get that job either. Oh my gosh, nude art model then. Let's do it. Come on, surely. What are we going to do? We need a job, man. What about a firefighter? Yes! Okay. We are a firefighter. Brilliant. What happens in the job world then? Oh, not a lot. We don't want to look for new jobs. We've just gone and got one. We need to pay off our debts, don't we? So now... We can go to the gym. Yes. Oh. Oh, because my bank balance is still negative. Right, okay. Well, let's work there for a year. And let's work for another year. <gasps> no. I don't want crack cocaine. Say no to drugs. Right, we are now in the positive with our bank balance. So now, can we go to the gym? Yes. Let's do it. Brilliant. Uh, it's another year. I'm now 25. And I think I'm going to look for some love. Um, let's find a date. While at the library you met a male named Charles. He's 20. How old am I? 25. He's a dishwasher at Le Family. No, he's a bit young for me. He's very smart though. Not my type. Let's go find another date. DJ Perez. Hmm. He's not very smart. Not my type either. Next one. Third time lucky. Brendan Roosevelt. 
graphic designer at Wang and Sons. He's crazy. He's smart. Let's ask him on a date. <gasps> My one out of 7.422 billion. I'm now dating Brendan. Oh, lovely. That's nice. Do we get to spend some time with Brendan? Um, let's go to the movies. Did he like it? Who knows? What else can we do with Brendan? We went to the theatre to see Girlfriend of My Imagination. He enjoyed it more than me. Oh, okay. Uh, what else we can do? Let's have a look at a job. No, I'm quite happy there. Let's have another year. 26 now. What happens at 26? I've been promoted to fire equipment operator. More money. Excellent. <gasps> uh oh. I'm expecting a baby. Well, let's keep it. And I've got bunions. Ouch. So, I don't know. Who do we see to fix bunions? Well, I doubt in real life it's a doctor. An alternative doctor? I am having a baby after all. Oh, I've sorted my bunions out. My feet hurt. Okay, brilliant. Oh, it didn't work. I've still got bunions. Let's go see a different doctor then. Let's go see Dr. Wright. I've still got bunions. Okay, well then in that case, we're going to go to an alternative doctor. Uh homeopathic do it was I brilliant I've still got bunions okay how are we gonna get on now then Brendan should we have a conversation well, it looks like we are having a baby let's have a chat then okay we seem to be doing well uh, 13,000 jobs going all right I am a firefighter now, though. A pregnant firefighter. I've had a baby boy. What should we call him? Harry. You are the proud mother of a baby boy named Harry Roosevelt. A smart and good looking. I am proud of you, son. Well done. I'm now 28. <gasps> you saw someone call your mother a fool. I'm going to insult her back. Yeah, do that. You leave my mum alone. Let's go on a vacation somewhere. Where should we go? Um, let's go to Orlando with our baby. And we'll fly economy because I haven't got that much. He wants to go with you and Harry wants to go with you. So we'll take them both. Family holiday. Do it. Brilliant. Did we have fun? I hope so, guys. Let's age a year now. 29. I'm now lieutenant. Very good. I'm doing well, aren't I? Well, yes, I will vaccinate him. It's very important to vaccinate your children. Uh, what else is going on? And I've paid off my student loan. Fabulous. Well, is it not time? I think we should try for another baby. How do we do that, though, Brendan? Brendan? Where are you? Brendan? Shall we have another baby? Let's have another baby. Let's try it. Oh, maybe don't try so hard. It might happen when you least expect it. Yeah, let's go clubbing. I've not been clubbing for a while. Brilliant. Singapore slings. Yeah, let's have one. Lovely. Oh. Packard has taken a liking to me and asks me to go to the cafe with him. I think I might politely decline. We don't want to make anybody upset, do we? What happens in the job? Anything else? No. We're well, right there. Assets. Can we buy a house or car? How much is a house? Sure, it's time we bought a house. Let's go shopping for a house. Uh, top worm? 87,000. What do, can we buy? 
a charming cottage. Oh, let's have a charming cottage. Two, one bedroom, two bathrooms. Is that what that means? That's no good. We want two bedrooms, one bathroom. Not quite yet ready for a house. Oh, mum died. Crack overdose. <clears throat> Who knew? I'll go to the funeral, of course. And now I'm captain. Jolly good. I'm doing very well as a firefighter, aren't I? Oh, how's dad? Now mum's died. Oh, dear. Let's go to the theatre, Dad. Yeah, I enjoyed it a bit more than my dad. Sorry, Dad. And we'll have another year. We're 35 now. Your boyfriend, Brendan, has asked you to marry him. We've been together for 10 years. I think so. I love Brendan. Yay! We need to get married. Let's spend some time together. Oh, soccer match. Lovely. And then we'll be 36. I'm now battalion chief. Fabulous. Surely we can buy a house now. We need two bedrooms. Oh, look, there's a three bedroom one there. A log cabin. Uh, what's the other estate agent got? A ranch. Oh, look, I like that ranch. Need more money. Next year. One more year then. Let's be 37. Uh, yeah, I have margarita. Oh no! I'm addicted to alcohol. <gasps> this is not good. Let's go get myself fixed, please. I still got bunions. What? Can we not fix the bunions? Oh, where did I see? The um, rehab, here we go. Tender meeting. Do it. Okay, I, oh dear, this is not good. Rehab, get me fixed. Normal. I hope I don't lose my job. No longer addicted. This is good. This is good. How's my relationship with Brendan? Oh, we're still good. Excellent. Okay, now can I have my house? I really like that ranch. Can we have the ranch? Is it still there? Uh, uh, uh. No ranch. Is it in the other one? A log cabin. Oh, that'd be quite nice. Let's have a log cabin. Oh, I still don't have enough money. Oh, I'm going to pay for a mortgage. Brilliant. And another year. Then we need to get married. I'm now assistant chief. I'm doing fabulously well. Right then, Brendan, let's get married. Let's do it. Wedding. Where should we get married? At the beach. Where should we go on honeymoon? Um, I don't mind. Let's go to Finland. Do it. Yeah. Uh, Brandon, beach, Helsinki. Do it. Well done. We're now married. Hooray! Fair party. Fifteen guests come. <gasps> noise. Apologise for noise. <gasps> Two underage drinkers? Man, a year in prison. Oh dear, we're going to hire the expensive guys to fix, save us. Yeah, well done, found not guilty. Gosh, that one's not good. Not good at all. What's next? We'll age a year. That's a busy old year. Oh, dad died. Let's go to funeral. Another year. We've been married five years now, Brendan and I. And my niece has started high school. Jolly good. Another year. Oh, Harry's graduated. Well done, Harry. Oh, no. Now I'm pregnant. Keep the baby. We've had a baby. Caitlin, great name. We'll stick with that. Well done. 47, gosh. Now, 
no, I'm not going clubbing, I'm staying home, I'm a recovering alcoholic. I s- yeah, well done, turn down that opportunity. Well done, Harry, he's promoted. Uh, where am I? I'm still fire chief. I'm going horse racing. Let's go, never been. Let's, what was that like? Uh, pick my horse. Jelly bean. Jelly bean. No, jelly bean. There we go. 5,000? You're joking. I just want to watch. I'm not betting $5,000. Start the race. It's jelly. Oh, see, jelly bean would have won. Yes, no. Oh, Patriot. Patriot wins. Well done, Patriot. Jelly bean came second. What should we do now? Think about retirement, surely. Oh, no! Got bronchitis. Off to the doctor we go. Yeah, you're going to fix my bunions. You keep giving me $66 treatment for bunions, but it never works. Just treat the bronchitis. Good. I've lived with the, bron- the bunions for so long now. Oh, no, now we're on constipation. Oh, 59 is not a good year for me. Back to the doctor we go. Let's have the other one this time. Constipation. Whew. That is uncomfortable. Oh. She died in a fatal boating accident. Oh, Electra, that's so sad. We've been 25 years, Brendan. Let's renew our vows, shall we? Well, I picked a good one there, didn't I? Oh, that's lovely. And then I think we should go on holiday. 25 years. I think that's a silver, isn't it? Vacation. Vacation. Where should we go? Barcelona. And we we'll take Caitlin with us, I guess. Fabulous. Do it. Fabulous. We had a lovely time. I'm now 65. Oh, she wants us to pay for her college. She wants to major in chemistry. No. She, oh, should I? See, I had to get a loan. It's going to cost six. Yeah, let's do it. Next. Oh, she decided to do English instead. Oh, Caitlin sounds a bit like fickle. Job. Time to retire, I think. Let's retire. 71. Let's do it. Occupation. These bunions just keep on giving. Oh, no. Brendan died of a stroke. Oh. That makes me sad. Oh, Brendan, I'm so sad. Let's meditate. Oh, I know. Will I ever be happy again? Brendan's died. Oh! So soon. This life is for living. Oh, I'm dating Dustin. Oh. We'll agree to disagree on that. I don't think Brenda and I ever had an argument. 78. How's my relationship with this dude? Is he just after me for my money? Who knows? We'll give him a compliment. Now I'm 79. Oh, he's died as well. He died in a bar fight. Ugh. He's a bit rough and ready, wasn't he? You know what I'm going to do at the age of 79? I'm going to go find some love on a one-night stand. Walter Zuckerberg. <gasps> Absolutely not. Dating app. 80 plus? Oh, should we go for a toy boy? Let's go for a toy boy. See if we can find someone 
who is 60. Desired income over that much. Let's try. Anybody meets that criteria? Jason Goff. Let's go on a date. Oh, true love, is it? Wow. 20 years my junior. I can pay him a compliment. Oh. Gosh, you called me awesome. I'm now 80. I'm now, what's going to happen at 84? Is asking you to take him to the theatre. Oh, why can't he take me? Hmm. Okay, Jason. Seems a bit of an interesting thing. We've been together five years. Uh, we're going to be 85 now. Oh. Oh. Don't want to marry him. I don't think I do, Jason. No. Um, Brendan was my true love. I can't. I can't do that to my children. Sorry, Brendan. No, Jason. He's asked me to marry him again. No. Sorry, I can't do it. Can't do it, Jason. I'm sorry. You need to understand that I love the man that is the father of my children. And I just can't marry someone else. It just can't happen. But I'll take you to the library instead. He's not happy about that, is he? He's not a happy man. But I can't, ha I'm a bit worried as well. Oh dear. He's not happy with me. I'm a bit worried that you asked me to take you to the theatre as well. You see, this is what concerns me, Jason. Is Why did you not take me to the theatre? 88. Again? Dude, get the message. I don't want to marry you. 90. Party when I'm 90. He's asked me again. I don't want to get married. Dude, you're getting on my nerves, right? Stop asking me. Again. Stop asking me. I'm going to dump you in a minute. 90. Can I get to 100? Ah. Uh, he's dead. Let's go to his funeral. I'm now 95. What should we do at 95? I'm feeling that I need a one night stand <laughs> at 95. No, I'm not giving you nude pictures. Is that what these one night stands want to do? A one night stand with a gentleman named DJ. <laughs> Let's do it. Always use a condom. Really? He didn't seem to enjoy it very much. Going to have another one night stand? <gasps> no. How rude. Try again. Oh, a gentleman named Brett Banks. <laughs> I'm 90 whatever, 97 and I'm going to have a pregnancy test? I don't think so. That'll be a miracle. 99. 100. Let's have a party. Oh, no. Oh, my son died. That's really sad. 102. Daniela, you just keep on giving. 103. 104. Find love. And 104. Let's say I have a nightcap with Lorenzo. Always. I can call him daddy. <laughs> 105. 106. I'm getting the world record for the oldest person alive at this rate.
off-duty police officer. Do it. Play video games. Let's do it. <laughs> 107. <laughs> One night stand. Let's do it. Always. <laughs> what? 108. 109. Can we get to 110? Ah, I died at 109. I was worth 1.6 million. Rest in peace. Look at that. Two children, one grandchild, one spouse, six lovers. Happiness, not too bad. Karma, good. Died at the grand old age of 109. Her funeral was attended by her daughter, Caitlin, her grandson and her niece. A fastidious young woman, she studied maths in college. Daniela got a job as a firefighter and was a faithful servant to Minneapolis Fire Department, working there for 49 years. Friends say they'll remember her as a bit, of, a bit on the granola side. So this brings me to the end of today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, please hit that like button and it would be fabulous if you'd subscribe. Don't forget to turn on the notifications though. I hope you find the video entertaining. It was great fun to make and I love sharing it with you. Until next time YouTube, ciao for now.